What's up guys, this is Mike from Terrestrial Imaging. Are you an owner of a unique Typhoon H, H520, or Q500 series drone? Do you find yourself taking everything out of your backpack storage case, setting it all up, putting the battery in, turning on the controller just to check the voltage of your battery? If so, you're going to want to keep watching this video. Before I show you how to check the voltage of your batteries the easy way, it's first important to explain why you would need to check your battery voltage at all. And so really there's two major reasons. One, obviously you need to know how much voltage is in your battery before you take flight because you're going to want to fly with a fully charged battery. Two, anyone dealing with LiPo batteries know that you can't leave your batteries in storage for an extended period of time with full voltage. You're going to want to lower that voltage before putting them away and not using them for an extended period of time. Now that we know why we need to check the voltage, let's check the voltage of our batteries the easy way. So right here on the table, what I have is a battery voltage reader for unique drones. Specifically, on this end you can see drones like the Typhoon H, H520, and Typhoon H Plus that all have those similar batteries. And the other side can check the voltage of the Q500 batteries. And this right here is available in our store. It goes for about $10. And so, the way it works is you take any one of your batteries, and this is the Typhoon H battery, for example. You take the voltage reader, you get the right end, and you put it in. Oops. Wrong way. You put it in, and displays the voltage right there for you. And so, real easy, we could see right away, this battery has 15.3 volts. And I didn't have to put it in my aircraft, I didn't have to turn on my controller, do anything. So next, I'm going to show you it works with the Q500 series batteries too. You just take the other end, you plug it in. And this one has got 12.3 volts. And then again, we could take the same end that we used for the Typhoon H battery, put in the H520 and we're going to get the voltage of that as well. And this one is at about 15.4 volts. So again guys, this is a much easier way to check the voltage of your unique batteries rather than getting your equipment out of your case, turning it on, putting the battery in, turning the controller on, and checking the controller display. That's it for this video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. So please stop making your life hard and just get one of these.